the Echo Slam. Oh, there it is. Forward. There's your slam. There's the dunk. Hello, Gamer Nom is back. So I've been reading your comments. For this video, we are going to use our previous Dragon Fruit account, and we will level this up from 1,500 to max level. I've been reading those comments. I don't want to let you down, so here we are. So in this account, we just reached level 1,500. So what's next? First, we are going to try and reach second C. We're gonna finish the quest, and then we will continue on leveling up. Okay, so let's go. So first up, to start the quest to reach second C, we need to go to the War Island and get the quest from this dude, the Traveler. Okay, and after that, we are going to go to the final island of this map, which is the Fishland. Oh, don't forget to save because you might die. Okay, <laughs> something like that. If you drown, etc., or whatever. Okay, so in this map, we are going to defeat this mob. Guys, again, don't get any other quests. So, how to defeat it easier? Try to attack it from afar. Again, we are going to defeat the Season Fishman again. There is a chance that you can get the map. If you don't get it, just keep on defeating it. Okay? So here you go. We've already earned the map. Now, we need to go back to the War Island. Give it to the Traveler. And after that, go to the first island. To the starting island. Here we are. The start island. And talk to the Elite Pirate. And after that, we can now go to the second C. Gamer Nom, why not start leveling up there? Guys, even if I want, there is a level requirement. I'm gonna show it to you. So for the le lowest level required, to start grinding in the second C, here we are. So you are required to at least have a level of 2,250. But guys, it's very hard to level up here in this area. Why? Aside from these bullies, check this out. It is very hard to lure. Check it out. I'm using the skills. Again, this is a dragon fruit. It's very easy to lure using this uh, devil fruit, etc. But guys, see that? I cannot lure them. So I suggest we won't be leveling up here. So off to the Fawn's land. Check this out. At level 2300, you need to defeat six beast pirates, right? Guys, it's very hard to lure again. Again, if we are going to level up here, we will be waiting lots and lots of time. And I don't like wasting time so I suggest we are going to level up in the first C until we reach 2350 why in this quest we are going to start defeating the snake man check this out guys the snake man only one after you defeat this level up finish quest off to the next quest right check that out only one combo we can finish this up Okay, so it's decided we are going to start leveling up in the second C when we reach level 2350, okay? Okay, 2350. Now let's go back to the first C and level up. Here we are, let's talk to this dude again. The elite pirate. A fast field trip to the second C and here we are, we are back in the first C. So at level 1500, I suggest we go here in the zombie island and start grinding with the zombies. You just need to defeat five. I'm gonna show you how to lure them fast. So again, you cannot use your second skill here. Use your third skill, the roar, to kill three zombies. Move to the next one. Use your X skill, your second skill, and your third skill, or your first skill. It depends to you. Okay, again, you're gonna do this until you reach level 1600. Again, guys, C skill to lure 3. There you go. And guys, you can use your B skill here. Okay, the dragon breath to one hit those two. Okay, so let's say you reach level 1600. You can now start defeating this, the Shadow Master. The weakness of this boss is it cannot attack aerial units. So those are, are in the air, it is safe. So just to make sure, just wait for a moment because if you do that, see that, I get damage. So wait for a moment after you defeat it. Okay, so again, one more time. Guys, we can defeat it with just uh, one combo. Check this out, guys. Avoid the ground. Look, see that? I get damage, okay? So do this until you reach 1,800. Again, 1,800. And after that, you can now go to the War Island. You can start grinding here by defeating these dudes. The rear admirals, just 50 level ups. So how do you lure them? Guys, again, I hate luring, but you need to do this. 
is your uh, Dragon Breath. See that? Lure 4. You need to defeat 6. So after this, you need to defeat only 2 more. Okay, so there you go. We defeated 4. Wait for the 2 to spawn. And defeat them. Okay? So again, you're gonna do this for only 50 level ups. Again, 50 level ups. So there you go. 1,850. After this, we're gonna move to the next quest. Is it fast, guys? Just comment it on the comment section, okay? So now, we're gonna defeat this, the true Fishman Karate. It's kinda easy to defeat since it's only one. There you go. We're gonna do this until you reach 1,925. Again, 1,925, guys. There you go. Don't forget to buy Observation Hockey. <laughs> So at level 1,925, you can start defeating this boss over here, the Quake Woman. You can level up here until you reach level 2,125. Okay? That's the max level. Oh no, 2,126. And when you reach that, you can go to the other island, which is the Fishland. But guys, again, you can start leveling up in the Fishland when you reach 2,050. It really depends to you. It's the same, guys. Defeat one and you will level up, okay? So here, you can defeat this until you reach level 2100, but I prefer leveling to 2100 in the War Island and start defeating this. The One Sword Fishman at 2100. Again, one kill is one level up. It's, it's the same. It's kind of easy leveling up when you reach this level. But guys, after this is the hardest part until you reach 3200. This is the hardest part, guys. This one. The seasoned fishman, it's very hard to defeat because you cannot dodge or you cannot burst him. So you really need to like finish this, reset, finish, reset, finish, reset. But don't worry for only 50 level ups. Because you will focus on the one sword fishman, this one, the sword fishman, until you reach 2300, okay? 2300, you will still level up. Check that out. Even at 2301, you can still level up. If you defeat this, one kill, one level up. See that? Okay, so at 2301, you cannot start defeating the Seasoned Fishman. I'm just showing it to you that if you reach 2301, your level, uh, the experience that you will get from that boss will drop. 90% drop, okay? So there you go, we are here in the Seasoned Fishman. We've reached 2350. Guys, that is the hardest part, the Seasoned Fishman part. And after that, everything will be easy, fast. You only need to be patient. Okay, so since we, we've reached 2350, let's start defeating the Snake Man. Okay, so again, Snake Man, use your B skill. And it really depends to you on what you're gonna use next. Z, X, C, as long as you hit your enemy and the quest is done. Fast, right? Oh, don't forget to do C, Beast Quest, C King. There you go. I tried it once. Just to show you, it's kind of easy since you're Dragon Fruit user, right? But the level is kind of low. Check that out, 500k, earn 4 gem, and let's go back to the Snake Man. You're gonna do this, the Snake Man quest, until you reach 2500. Gamer, now we're gonna skip quests again. Yes, we're gonna skip quests. And after that, you're going to the Hibernus land and start defeating the Violet Samurai. We skip two kinds of quests because why? Why, 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 gamer no? Those are lure quests again, okay? And this one, you're just gonna defeat one and the quest is done. Level up is very fast. So when you reach level 2600, we can now go to Floresca. Guys, we skip one quest again. Why? Because that quest is almost the same as the Violet Samurai, okay? Oh, sorry, Floresco. Guys, avoid this dude. Those who want to like fight one-on-one, -on -one, this will just make grinding uh, slower you when you reach max level you can do that so at 2600 you can start defeating the batman it's kind of easy again guys it's kind of easy there you go just use your first uh, your dragon breath first skill and i think it's done there you, okay just use your other skills to make sure okay do this until you reach 2650 guys the leveling up in this area is kind of near the range okay the margin so it will really make you level up faster okay 
So again, when you reach 2650 off to the next mob and the quest giver is just beside you, the Kitsune Samurai. Again, it is easier to defeat this B skill. Uh, use your Z skill. There you go. Your X and C. But gamer, now I get damage. Guys, I'm gonna show you how to burst this. You need to be near B skill, X skill, and C skill, and that's it. Okay. So after that, at 2850, you need to go to Carcer to defeat the Bear Man. Guys, I really max out my leveling up in the Kitsune Summer because this Bear Man is the toughest dude in this whole leveling up video. So you're gonna defeat this until you reach 2900. See that guys, only 49 levels. This mob is so tanky. Okay, I'm gonna show it to you. Z skill, B skill, see that? Still alive, another Z skill, C skill, and X skill. See that guys, more than one combo. After that, let's go to the Torefasho and start defeating the Patchy Woman. So here you go, we're almost done guys, 2,800, is that fast? Yes, it is really fast. Gamer Gnome, how long did you level up? I think 6, 7 hours, something like that. It's really fast guys, don't worry, it's the Dragon Fruit. Okay, so again, we're gonna defeat this by using one combo plus another one skill, okay? So Z, X, Z, V, and 1 Z is enough to defeat the Patchy Woman. So you're gonna do this until you reach 2,950. And after that, you can now go to Virijans. Don't forget to save and start defeating the Kappa. So here, the Kappa, 2950. It's very easy to defeat the Kappa. Again, I think the Kappa cannot damage you. Or just one hit at a time. Okay, so 4-1 Observation Hockey, 1 set, 8 defeats, 8 kills. Not bad. So again, when you reach level 3000, you can now go to the other side of this island. Your next quest, the Mammoth Man. I think you need to level up here for 75 times. So here you go, how to defeat it, very easy again. Same as the Kappa, use your B skill, Z skill, X skill, and C skill. And again, one Z skill. Actually, everyone's quite tanky in this part because we're almost max level. So there you go guys, when you reach level 3075, you can now go to the last island, guys the sky island, gamer no, there are other islands, I don't care guys, this is for reaching level 3200 and this island is the fastest way to do it, why? Guys you just need to like comment, let's hunt Kaido guys, or do a party and they will help you grind this, see that because this is the map where you can get the black stone where you will summon Kaido and everyone is doing that in this see almost everyone okay the mob is easy to defeat but with your friends it is a lot easier okay so do this until you reach your max level and that's it okay guys so how's that for a video if you want more videos like this how about the phoenix fruit but before that i'm gonna post a video of level one noob string fruit so watch out for that Again, to all the viewers, subscribers, supporters, I appreciate you all. This is GamerNom, and GamerNom out. Bye-bye.